Hey guys, this is Down Phoenix, and today I have Bio Phoenix, a good YouTube friend of mine, who I recently streamed some Sega Genesis Classics games with, and we're going to test out a theory, because I have a theory that the bad net code of this game can be circumvented by using SharePlay, at least if you're on the PS4. If you've got it on another system, you're kind of out of luck. So, Bio Phoenix, you can go ahead and introduce yourself to anybody that magically doesn't know who you are. Hey everyone, this is Bio Phoenix here, and um, yeah, I just upload a bunch of random reviews, mostly on obscure stuff. So, anyway, so, yep, we're going to play some Sega shit. Yeah, so we're going to try the share play functionality. For anybody that doesn't know, share play allows you to essentially share your game with another person remotely. That can be for co-op or passing the controller or all kinds of stuff like that. So we're going to go ahead and start the share play session. I haven't even tested the connection yet. I'm going to assume it's good enough. So, <laughs> Alright, it says it's good enough. So let's do it. So while the game is loading, I was wondering, we should touch upon a couple of games where the lag was especially notable. Uh, which one would you uh, like to try Streets first? Streets of Rage 2. Streets of Rage 2, yeah. I mean, we played a good chunk of it, but uh, I think that'll be a definitely... I liked a lot on my end, though. <laughs> oh, yeah, especially on your end. Um, I think one of the benefits of the share play here is we shouldn't have quite as much of a problem with that. And you can kind of let me know your thoughts on it, because you're the one that's kind of like on the other end of it. I have so far, it seems but, pretty good. Well, yeah, this is the menu, though. <laughs> I don't think there'd be too much trouble on the menu, except I can't select the character for some reason, but there you go. You have to use, I think, circle to actually select. Are you able to select? It's not doing anything. Hmm. No. I thought you could co-op with SharePlay. Play a game together. There we go. Now you should be good. Okay, yeah, there we go. <laughs> don't forget to do that if you were to do this, of course. Okay. All right. So the thing I noticed, like, for me, it's obviously a lot better because I'm playing the game locally. Like, it's not seeing any kind of internet connection at all. Whereas online, I was definitely noticing problems because it was, like, giving both of us lag. How are you feeling about it so far? Um, it's noticeable, but not nearly as bad. Yeah, it's like a, like, like a little delay, maybe. Yeah, like, like this is, like, way manageable. Yeah. Oh, whoops. <laughs> yeah, still doing that problem, of course. But, yeah, I, I'm definitely noticing a difference here. And, you, like you said, you, you said it felt a lot better. It's not giving us that constant stutter. It's more of, like, just a little delay in the controls, I'm guessing. Yeah, it's just a little bit. Yeah. Not terrible. Yeah. Especially if it's a game definitely... that you've played a lot, you know? I mean, you can kind of, like, you just get used to things, you know? Oh, yeah, that's yeah, true. Like, when you have a delay, if it's cons if it's fairly consistent, you just try to compensate for it, you know, and then it's not too bad. But, uh, yeah, I think Streets of Rage is definitely a pass on this, for sure. And the great thing about SharePlay, only one of you have to own the game. So oh, yeah, it's true, eh? Yeah, let's check out another game. I one that was, like, basically unplayable was Biohazard Battle. I want to check that game out, because that game is awesome. So yeah, we're going to check out Biohazard Battle. This is an awesome shmup game uh, that you can do two-player two player, two co-op. The weird thing is with this game, uh, when me and uh, K-Sound played it, it actually wasn't that bad with the lag. Yeah. I don't know, maybe, well, were you, was he streaming too, like I was, or was it just... Yeah, he, he, he was streaming, uh, yeah. Yeah, maybe you guys had just had a better connection or something. Yeah, I'll be yeah, the screen bug. Well, I mean, we are both on the East Coast, so... Yeah. But yeah, this game, it was just constant stop, start, stop, start, you know. I'll, I'll show you guys, oh, like, yeah. nice little comparison so you can see how the gameplay looks compared to what we're looking at now. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is way better. Yeah. Oh, yeah, for sure. I'm not getting any kind of delay. The game plays exactly like it's supposed to. Yeah, wow, SharePlay has actually saved the day. Yeah. I mean, I don't think we even got past, like, stage two trying to play it online. 
I think we did. Did we get to stage two? I think we did. Yeah, we got to stage two. Yeah, because this first stage, it's easy. You just got to do this little segment for like two minutes, <laughs> if even that. But yeah, I really love the charge shot. It reminds me a lot of uh, Panzer Dragoon. Yeah, this game's great. I was surprised he even put it on here in this. Yeah. Well, I didn't know it was a Sega game. That's what it surprised me about. Although that makes that calls into question where the hell are games like Outrun at? Well, or Fantasy I think I know Zone. The to that, but it's stupid. <laughs> yeah. Oh, is it the whole Ferrari thing or something? Yeah, it's the Ferrari thing. Yeah, that sucks. I know, it's like, it's just, just make it a red fucking car. Like, who gives a shit? They all look the same. Well, yeah, they don't want to, they don't want to actually do any effort to change sprites or anything like that, so. Or, like, at least edit the ROM file to remove any references to the Ferrari. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. By the way, he's the one that's been constantly going up and down. <laughs> I don't well, know if that's just, just your I'm strategy. Doing. I just like to spread as much yeah, bullets yeah, that's as you can. Strategy in this game. Yeah, I mean it's not a bad strategy. It just kind of makes you vulnerable unless you know where, where you're where you're coming up against, of course. Yeah, because this is a game I'm not like crazy familiar with. Yeah. Like if I was playing like, oh I don't know, like uh, yeah, like G Darius or something. Oh, G Darius, be good with that one. Oh yeah, I I'm pretty good at that one. Oh, I like this ring shot, man. This is awesome. I mean, at least for front stuff. Obviously, it's not doing any good if you got any stuff behind you. Okay, yeah, I noticed a little bit of lag, but not like. Oh yeah, bad. yeah, yeah, yeah. We both got a death, but I think at this stage we were like already out of lives <laughs> trying to play oh, normally. Yeah. Like, he yeah. We barely got through it. But yeah, it's definitely playable. I think you can manage it, especially if you got a good connection. I mean, Bio Phoenix lives in, uh, what is it, like Eastern Canada? Like, do you live around, like, uh, the Toronto area or something? In, that? Yeah, Toronto area, yeah. Yeah, so I mean, we're a good 1,500, 2,000 miles away, and we're not doing too bad, I think. Well, I'm not doing too bad. You're dead. <laughs> But, yeah, I died. But no, well, it, it actually didn't like that bad. Yeah, let's let's check out one more game just to kind of see if this holds up with some other games. What else did we check out that we had a lot of trouble with? Do you remember? I think there was a fucking shitty Crackdown. Oh yeah, Crackdown. Well, I mean that <laughs> who's actually going to play that game, right? <laughs> yeah, that's that's just fair. Yeah. Oh, uh, Gunstar Heroes. Gunstar Heroes. Yes, that's a classic for sure. I mean, it's pretty much a bust if you can't play Gunstar Heroes online. And I know on the Xbox 360 version, I just got a trophy for experiencing history for some reason. Not sure why, but oh, that's for playing twenty different games. Oh, okay. Apparently, I never played Gunstar Heroes in this collection, even though I did. But okay. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, anyways, uh, they had the Xbox 360 version of Gunstar Heroes you could play online on. It worked okay, great. we'll just start at the beginning stage. That's kind of the... Because we didn't... Yeah. I don't think we even beat the stage. That's how bad it was. <laughs> no. No, we didn't beat it. Yeah. I don't know why I chose laser, but I guess it's working out for me. Alright, yeah. I mean, this is a game that you definitely have to have good timing, because there's just a lot of stuff happening everywhere. So how are you feeling about it so far? Oh, uh, pretty good, actually. Like, this is, like, way, way better. Yeah. I mean, you're just completely wrecking this dude here. <laughs> he couldn't even get a hit off. You can go ahead and take the health, because you actually took a little damage. All right. Yeah, this guy won't be in trouble. Oh, I'll kill the... Never mind, I was going to kill the uh, things, but it didn't work out. Sorry, I'm trying to get to the... Late... I don't know if you wanted the homie... I wanted to get this here, because this thing wrecked. Oh, I, I got the homing. The lightsaber. <laughs> it's a little risky, but it's really powerful. Yeah, this one, they, I think, is probably lighting the worst right now, but it's still better than what it would have been yeah. before. Well, I wonder if it has anything to do with just the action on the game. You think that has anything to do with it? I mean, because there is a lot of stuff going on. You can buy a hazard, too, but... Yeah, you need to get the health, man. Yeah, as you can tell, that's why I'm playing like shit. Yeah. This one you might be a little careful at. 
Oh, good timing on that throw. I don't, I don't know if I don't think that was intentional, but <laughs> it worked out. No, I, I usually try not to do that, but <laughs> okay. Well, try to. Okay, I was gonna say wait until uh, we got done with this part because you just killed me. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, we're still not doing the best, but I mean, to my credit, I haven't played this game in forever, so. Yeah, I was I'm never really good at this game. Alright, let's just ignore the bees. The bees will just kill us. Okay, never mind, I'm dead now. Grab the health before you die, too. There we go. I'm back in now. They definitely need to brush up on my Gunstar Heroes, but. I don't know, I think that wasn't too bad. I mean, especially if you're close enough, you might consider doing share play instead of uh, using Sega's actual netcode, because it sucks. Yeah, that was really disappointing. Hmm. Yeah, hopefully they'll patch it or, or something. I mean, that was like one of the only reasons I bought this collection. And it's like, ugh, can't even do that, really. But share play yeah, kind of kind of sort of saves a day depending on the game. Like this game, yeah, not the best, but I mean, you could easily do something like Streets of Rage, no problem. Yeah, no, that one was probably like the best fitting one for this. Yeah. So uh, thank you guys very much for tuning in. I would like to thank Bio Phoenix for popping in on the video. Yeah, no problem, man. All right. So with that, down Phoenix out. <laughs>